Come now, Bushranger. Do try and keep up. Asuba, Wisa, Asuba, the Asa, Baba. Those two guards look like they could use some sleep. I just gave them a simple suggestion. A nudge in the right direction. Try to relax, my friend. We are nearly there. Ah! More intruders! Wait! Where are the guards I sent for you? They're taking a quick nap. I was hoping we could speak alone. The treachery committed by outsiders continues to mount. Go ahead. Kill me. Just know that another will take my place, as willed by the Great Tree. I only wish to know more about this tree and its people. I feel its energy flowing strongly through the Force. Hmm. You have positive aura about you. I can sense that you're telling the truth. Very well. I will indulge you. I will tell you the great mystery of the tree and of the god Clombo. The god Clombo. Risa, Batu, Parava, Nito, Firisa, Desu, Pirasu, Noata, Fisa, Kurasa, De. The Colombo's connection to nature is no coincidence, for their merge is written upon the stars themselves. The Reality Tree, the Colombo's, they are all connected. Nature is fighting back, even as darker forces arrive to claim it for their own. While I may not agree with the nature of your beliefs, these forces you speak of are a very grave threat. I want to help you face them. Praise the Clombo God! Praise the Great Tree! Perhaps not all outsiders are as cruel as I am. Hope I'm not interrupting anything. Django Fett. Close. Ah, Bush Ranger, are you all right? Your friends have been dealt with, old man. You're not Django. You're his son, Boba. I'm just a simple man trying to make my way in the universe. So, if you'll indulge me, I have a bounty to collect. Hold still. Ah. Oh. Ah. You'll have to do better than that. The Elder. So long, Kenobi! Stranger! Stay with me now. Conserve your energy. My energy has been spent. My aura has returned to the Great Tree. Follow its roots, stranger. The mystery will be revealed. Just let it guide you. I don't understand. You will, but now I must rejoin nature as the god Clombo wills. Vader is making moves. I need to prepare if I am to face him again. I cannot do this alone after all. 998? 999? 1,000! Ha ha ha! A cool grand! Sky, come in. Sky, it's Ben. Huh? Who's Ben? Some desert hobo I met a little while ago. I heard that. Anyways, you were right, Sky. I need your help after all. What's this all about? You may know that your friend Sky felt a presence the other day. I felt it too. It saddens me to say that that dark presence is none other than my former student, Darth Vader. Darth Vader? Huh. So how come Sky was able to tell he was here? 
Where I'm from, we'd call such a being force sensitive. Force sensitive? What's the force? The force is an energy field created by all living things. It surrounds us and penetrates us. It binds the galaxy together. It grants us Jedi our power. But for you, for this island, I feel it is different. What do you mean? What we call the Force, you here might simply call nature, energy, life, or even light. It manifests itself in many different ways, most of which are unknown to me even now. You might have seen things, felt things, that others couldn't. That is what I'm talking about, no matter what title we give it. I think I understand. So, am I gonna get one of those cool laser swords, or...? <laughs> Regardless, in order to combat Vader, I need to further explore this island's mysteries. I've been tasked with seeking out the roots of the reality tree. I knew we were guarding it for a reason. Yes, and you must continue to do so while Sky and I investigate its roots. I guess you and Ollie are headed for another adventure. Ollie! I'm sending you coordinates. Meet me there. And Sky, may the Force be with you. And also with you. Don't, that's... never mind. So, you trust this guy? Yeah, I do. I have to, because otherwise, that presence I felt. It was that bad, huh? Don't worry, Sky. We took on worse threats than this. This Vader guy won't know what hit him. Sense your presence. Come and face me. Now, charge! Stay away from this sacred place! The Clombo remains must be preserved. Sweetness! The darkness is too strong! Stand and fight! It's what you call a clombo around here. They're a lot like a panther, just less furry. Lots of people on this island care about them. It's only a little creepy. Bounty Hunter, have you succeeded in your mission? Not exactly. He didn't tell me a Jedi was gonna be there. And it wasn't just any Jedi. It was... Obi-Wan. Yeah. Years ago, he thought my dead. And then the Jedi killed him. And now you have a chance for revenge. That moment passed a long time ago. The man who killed my father got himself thrown out a window. Turns out, he didn't fly so good. Wish I could have been there to see it happen. Regardless, Kenobi will make a fine consolation prize. You may be skilled, Bounty Hunter, but you are no match for Obi-Wan. Then what do you suggest? There is a darkness on this island. Individuals gifted with the Force. I want them bound and brought to me. They will become my new Inquisitors. Jedi Hunters. Well, I suppose I can share the spoils of war. Of course, I will expect to find his feet. Do not push your luck, Bounty Hunter. They don't call me the best for nothing. Bring them to me alive. No disintegrations. As you wish. Hello there. Hey, Ben. Huh. This place looks different. Different? Different how? Ahoy, mateys. Welcome to the new and improved Lazy Lagoon. I am, of course, Captain Blackheart. I'm gonna let you do the talking with this guy, Ben. Hello, friend. My name is Ben, and this is Sky. Oh, I know who Sky is, mate. She's a legend. Her and her little hat there. Mommy! Yeah, that's the one. Come on up here now. Make yourselves comfortable. 
Welcome aboard. Ain't she a beaut? I think I'll christen her buccaneer after me ex. That's wonderful. Now, about why we're here. Of course. I assumed it was because you've heard of my exploits and wanted to see the good captain for yourselves. I'm afraid not. You see, we are following the roots of the reality tree. Some of them lead here. Ah, you know, I was wondering what was going on with that. Kind of an eyesore, no? I am not here to judge. Now, when exactly did this place become Lazy Lagoon, as you called it? Well, it must have been a week ago now. I'm loving it, mate. There was a lumberjack here, though. I think the bloke's name was Kylo or Kyle or something. He wasn't too happy, but can't be helped, can it? Hmm. The force is strong in this place. If I can tap into it. Hey, what are you doing, mate? I am trying to commune with the tree's roots below the surface. Maybe I can... Oh, my. What the... What have you done? My lagoon! My precious lagoon! Um, apologies. Ah, this is just great. I ain't an outlaw, mate. I'm a pirate. Let me try to tap into the power once more. Good. Although, I did think of a good cowboy name. You ready? Tilted Red, eh? Eh? Has a nice ring to it, don't you think? Please, Blackheart. I need to concentrate. Of course. Suit yourself. Oh, you miffed it. It's even worse than before. Oh, I'm feeling kind of woozy now, mate. Look, I've got a massive hangover. Interesting. Let me try again. No, no, that's quite all right. I can't take another flash like that. Also, I don't want you turning this place into some yuppie hangout or something next. I'll make do. But I will have to ask you now, politely, to leave. There are other routes we can investigate. It was a pleasure meeting you, Captain. Yeah, sure, likewise. Now get out of here, you weirdos. I need to lie down. Gunner, this must sting for you, being on the other side of the bars for once. Yeah. How do you like it? I'm here because Evie promised a fair trial, not to be mocked. Come now, dearie. You should have expected this. After all, how many times did you lock up these two? At least twice for me. But fine, if you want to hear your sentence so badly, let's get on with it. First off, you're guilty. Clearly. But now we have to decide on an appropriate punishment. Luckily, Origin and I have already made that decision. You did manage one thing, Gunna. You got the Imagined and I to agree on something. Let's stop beating around the bush. What's the verdict? Foundation off hunting Geno and Paradigm MIA. It falls to us to make this decision. Gunnar, you are to be executed for your crimes. What? No! I should have expected this. I knew coming here was a mistake. You can't do this. Scientist, talk some sense into them. Hmm? Scientist's helmet is having a malfunction. AKA, his latest experiment blew out his voice box. Needless to say, he agrees with us. Aha! It's not unanimous after all. Please, listen to me. The Peace Syndicate could use a man like Gunnar. I was only the muscle, not the brains. That much is clear. But now I can be muscle for you. Besides, we've already told you, he wants to make amends. Shouldn't we give him the chance? A second chance? He worked for Sloan. He helped that mad woman slaughter hundreds. Uh Huh. What is it? (sighs) I can't believe I'm saying this, but Evie's right. I am? She is? I'm only here because I was given a second chance. If what Gunnar says is true, then I must afford him the same courtesy. Ugh, come on! This isn't the same thing! You were the Cube Queen's husband. You didn't have a choice. Gunnar killed for money. For fun! Are you saying that you've never enjoyed the thrill of battle imagined? I have my doubts. I... fine. If the Peace Syndicate can use Gunnar, so be it. He can at least be useful before he's killed. Evie, put him on the front lines. I, I imagined. Did you hear that, Gunnar? You work for me. You won't regret this. I'll do my best. Thank you. Now, the real work begins. Are you coming, Gunnar? I'm right behind you. Well, what do you think? I love it! The clothes, the hair. This suits you well, big guy. <laughs> Thanks. Um, what is it? It just... It feels good. I know they still don't trust me, but 
to be given a second chance. It's like I'm starting a whole new life. A life devoted to protecting the peace. Exactly. I'm gonna rock it. I have no doubt. With the Syndicate and the Seven working together, this island is safer than it's ever been before. Then let's make sure it stays that way. You read my mind. The scientist outfitted us with his newest tech. Apparently, it's already seen some field testing, but more couldn't hurt. Shall we? Let's do this! Woohoo! Woohoo! 